Hey everybody, it's Death Adder at the Death Shop. Getting ready to cook some uh, pasta on my own here. Got the uh, yum 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 flour ready. Got some Parmesan Reggiano. We're going to be doing some shrimp uh, shrimp fettuccine tonight, actually. So anyway, this isn't about cooking, so it's not a cook to death episode. I'm going to blow on you just a little bit because I can see that uh, my camera lens has got a little bit of stuff on it. And I can't go there and be bothered to make it again. So there you go. There's a little brush in for you. Get some ASMR on. <laughs> anyway, here's uh, what I did get. We got some strawberries today. Those are going into a cheesecake for me for my birthday. <laughs> got a couple more Roma tomatoes. These ones are from the garden. These are ones I got the other day. Ooh. Never mind the uh, ugly little stuff on the rubber made. And also... To go in the cheesecake two extra berries we picked what i could get off of my blueberry bushes so we got some blueberries so there we go finally got some stuff out there i also pulled the first cantaloupe of the year the first cantaloupe of the year was <laughs> and it made me understand the reason why even though i i go there and grow those things all season and they take a big huge amount of space why i won the that about the yeah it's bigger than the size of my fist it was like the size of a softball is worth it it's because the flavor is just insane and then I have over here whoo, one of the dahlias that I picked so there's that but anyway uh, we're gonna come over here to the window and as you can see still gray outside let me see if I can get a better look for you from this other side here of the garden and everything else here but you can still see it's dark and gray and ugly and I did see a ton of birds in my yard the other day so I decided the raspberries I did actually string them back up today but I decided that because we got a lot of hungry birds out there right now that aren't flying very well due to the uh, smoke that's still outside because this is day what six I mean it's getting better but we did have a south wind today coming blowing straight north so I'm expecting it to get worse tonight but since we had so many birds that uh, were out there I decided I'm gonna leave the nets off and not net the raspberries this year let them come in and eat what they want because uh, hey I'm a friend of nature too so <laughs> Speaking of that, I, when I went up there to do the stringing, apparently there was a huge amount of bees, a huge amount of honeybees all over because there's still flowers up there too. So, so uh, I did not get stung once. So that's a, that's a testament. They they flew around me, they explored me a little bit, buzzed around my ears a little, <laughs> which was a little bit a little bit unsettling because I'm not used to you know having that right there next to me, but. But uh, yeah, the sisters there were really nice to me, so so don't have to worry about that. Oh, and one other thing too, Ugh. I pulled, uh, I did pull my little artichokes. They are little, they definitely are little, but I pulled those. Those will not be tonight, but they'll be some other time. So kind of giving you a garden update in the middle of all this. I'm not going to show you how to make shrimp fettuccine tonight because, yeah. My recipe is old and ancient, and I've been using it for years, so not ready to give out the big secrets yet. <laughs> anyway, guys, want everybody to take care. Keep wearing your masks out there, especially with the smoke. Those guys in the smoky areas, the good news is, is uh, Lincoln City's back to, well, getting people back in their houses. A lot of areas are burnt down. The one friend that we do have that's MIA uh, on Facebook likely had her stuff torched according to the uh, lines that uh, that they the perimeters they had established likely had all our stuff torched and uh, probably didn't have a uh, I mean she I know she's old so old that she probably doesn't have a, a smartphone so so she probably has no way of communicating with everybody right now because uh, probably had uh, her passwords written down and got those torn up too with the thing or probably had it to where it was set up to I'll log in automatically so and that's just the way it is I'm gonna assume that they're okay but at the same time nobody's heard from them yet so if 
but they did say that they went through the debris, the crews went through the debris, and nobody lost their lives, so that's good. But here we go, look at this though. Oh, pan's ready, pot's ready, <laughs> another pot's ready. We're gonna be making some stuff tonight, and I'm gonna enjoy. <sighs> it's been a long year, long way to this, and we finally have everything set up for vacation, so I'm very happy. Very happy indeed. <laughs> Say hey, vacation video's coming, guys. Woo! Yay! It's been a long time, hasn't it? This year, it tried. And it tried to take that vacation away from me, but I said no. We're gonna take everything down. We're gonna do everything different. And we've got one coming, so here we go. Anyway, everybody, take care of the stuff out at the dust shop. Saying I'll catch you later. Stay safe out there, guys. See you next time.